Hi folks, this is Gold Teeth and today we're gonna talk about how you can prepare a circuit board for gold extraction. Basically what you want to do is to heat up the circuit board so the lead melts and you can remove your components from the circuit. Um, now before we go any further Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification button. Thank you. Uh, previously, we said that um, for um, lowering the cost of the uh, production, by production I mean recycling, we need to use uh, nitric acid and copper. This will uh, make the process cheaper and will bring us more profit. Now the first step that I'm going to explain is uh, to prepare the surface for the acid pool. Um, our circuits will look like something like this. Um, these are old mobile phones. Um, in the place of the buttons, like one first button is one, second button is two, and basically the buttons have gold underneath. Um, it's yellow, so if you want to purchase these boards, um, it, uh, the place of the buttons should be yellow. And um, these kind of boards has one gram, uh, more or less, uh, one gram of um, pure gold. Um, and it does not need any specific uh, preparation. As you can see, there is no components attached to the um, surface. It's really easy to use. Um, the next one here um, um, has a lot of gold because um, there, there's gold plated on it and th it takes a lot of surface. Um, then the, the only thing you need to do with this board uh, is to remove components and then scissor it and make it to um, smaller pieces for your beaker and for your acid pool. Uh, this one here is Nokia Cardian. Uh, it has uh, lines of gold on it. Uh, the lines are thick. Uh, it has a kind of like <coughs> two grams more or less uh, gold uh, in it. Uh, but you got to remove all these ICs CPUs from the face of the face of your board. And this one here is Nokia Ericsson uh, you can see uh, ICs you can see um, there is some gold in ICs and other components that I'm showing here they are all black but it's like hidden uh, in some plastic that takes another process to uh, prepare for gold extraction I will make a video for that uh, okay, so uh, we have a circuit board here, we have a circuit board, board here, but which one has more gold? As you can see, the gold is plated on the surface of this one, we call it number one, uh, and as you can see, there is more a space of the board plated with gold. But in number two, there is only uh, lines of gold, so... Um, as you can see, the, f the first one has more gold in it. So for the uh, preparation of the surface, you need to use a torch and a sharp tool to remove the components. Uh, the point uh, of using a um, torch is to use the heat, but that heat um, of the torch is a flame and is, it is so direct. And it's a direct flame and the temperature of this place is actually very hot. It can burn your circuit board. Uh, this will cause um, some gases. These gases can be bad for your health. Um, other thing is it burns the circuit and um, the components of the surfaces beneath that we don't want in our uh, acid pool will uh, come to our acid pool and we will make some troubles. 
the next thing you need to know is that lead uh, hardens very fast so as you apply the um, torch torch flame to your circuit uh, you have only like two or three seconds to remove your components otherwise it will harden and if you put more heat to that um, you will burn your circuit board so the uh, tools I used is this torch and um, for scissoring it um, I used the sheet scissor looks like something like this um, it's really easy to use you, you only need to uh, cut the circuit boards and to the size of your beaker these are some components I removed using the torch um, the problem with the um, torch is that the flame and the temperature is <laughs> and the heat is too direct um, it can easily burn the board burn your tools as you can see here uh, this is uh, my sharp tool and it's burned from the edges because the flame was too hot and uh, it actually burned my hand too uh, it's really better to use a screwdriver um, so um, the cons of this method comes with a direct heat and the pros comes uh, with a with a not directed heat with a um, distance heat like you distance from the uh, your circuit or uh, you use uh, a tool like this it's called the uh, industrial uh, it's called an industrial drawer uh, and it um, uses the air to um, heat up your um, circuit boards it wouldn't um, burn your uh, circuit it was uh, so you won't get any dangerous uh, gases or burn your uh, circuit boards it's like twenty dollars twenty thirty dollars um, and it's it's you can easily purchase this uh, it really makes it easier to use um, so uh, this was um, surface preparation make sure to like and comment and tell me if you ever uh, had problem in um, um, gold extraction in f surface preparation um, the uh, next video uh, we will um, talk about how we can and make an acid pool and um, what is the temperature and time of our acid pool I uh, will make a, a video if, if you haven't watched any other videos please uh, watch the previous video so you can understand what all these videos are about thank you for watching